Welcome back guys, so, this is another uh, holiday ride and uh, we are going to have an off-road experience with the Royal Enfield uh, motorcycle today. So Royal Enfield has uh, put up an off-roading event at uh, Thrunleli and uh, my good friend and uh, fellow YouTuber, my neighbor Kyle92 Riders invited me for the ride and uh, today we are on our uh, way to the ride. He is on his Java motorcycle and uh, one more friend of mine is uh, coming behind me in his uh, Royal Enfield uh, Himalayan. So, riding the ZXNR and the Royal Enfield motorcycles are a different experience altogether. Both are uh, completely different uh, category of uh, motorcycles. and. Uh, I haven't done uh, off-roading uh, with my motorcycles so far because uh, all my motorcycles are uh, sports motorcycles and uh, doing uh, off-roading with a sports motorcycle is uh, next to impossible. So today I'm going to try my hands on a Royal Enfield in an off-road uh, track so let's see how this is going to pan out yes these off-road motorcycles are uh, pretty good on the mud tracks and on uh, roads with bumps whereas the ZX is uh, good on the highways but uh, on the speed breakers and the mud tracks you have to be extra careful with the motorcycles like the ZX and uh, other super sport motorcycles so the place uh, where the event is happening is some uh, 60 kilometers away from here so we have just begun our uh, ride and uh, we are less than five minutes into the ride I think it is better to let the adventure motorcycles do the talking on these roads and let the ZX follow them peacefully. Because on the speed breakers, the ZX is having a tough time while these adventure type motorcycles are very comfortable on these roads.
So road construction work has been uh, going on and in some places the roads are very bad and uh, some places they have laid down the roads perfectly. It is no wonder that uh, sports bikes like these at Exton are struggle on these uh, roads because these tires are uh, meant to be run on uh, perfect tarmac and uh, when uh, the roads are poor these uh, tires don't get uh, enough traction to hold the motorcycle properly and when that happens the motorcycle loses its uh, stability and that's a risky thing so to avoid such things it is uh, better to keep slow when the road is uh, not so uh, good of course on the roads like this where it is good you can uh, twist the throttle And I have to say, after a very long time, I am doing a group ride. Though it is a very short ride, this is a group ride for me. It is in fact true that the group rides give some sort of uh, happiness which you will never get in the solo ride Here we are about to enter the national highway and the destination is uh, some 4 or 5 kilometers from here.
and here we are at the Panama Cafe 